Hi guys. So my camera died. So this is my very last last haul, and it's gonna be lush. Um, as I said in my Nordstrom online, uh, Sephora Origins kind of haul. Um, this is I got the basic base basics that I always do. I always do bath bombs and bubble bars. I got like the strawberry bubble bar. Um, it's like the little mushroom one that's new for Valentine's Day. Uh, it's come out before. And I also got um, Phoenix Rising. I want to try that one out with um, typical. I got like uh, the French Kiss one because it's more lavender infused and so that's kind of what I was going for. Um, but the other things I got, I wanted to show you like the more interesting things I feel like that I've gotten. Um, Oat Fix. I decided to try this because um, with my cold, my nose, the skin around my nose is very dry and it is winter so my skin is more prone to be drier to normal um, than more oily. So I decided to give this a try. Oat Fix is actually really good smelling. I've had a few that are not so good smelling. One is like, smells like, um, God, what is a uh, Garlic. It smells like garlic. I really liked that, but the smell was very bad. So if you can't handle that, it was one to stay away. <coughs> I just haven't tried again. These were the fresh face masks that you have to get in store. Um, you collect five of these, paint po uh, these black pots, and you get to take them in and get a new one for free. But this one is a delicious blend of bananas, vanilla, and oats to cleanse, soften, and moisturize dry and sensitive skin. Apply to clean skin, avoiding eye area. Leave on 5 to 10 minutes and rinse away with warm water. Keep chilled. So you keep this in your refrigerator. I really like this one. It smells good. I want to test it on my face for sure. But I just thought it would help because I have like really dry, cracked skin around my nose right now from being sick. And then I... I love this one fragrance they've had, and I finally caved and bought a fragrance bit of it because they also have it in soap. So this is Lust, their Gorilla Perfume um, at Lush, and it's amazing. I don't know how to explain it. I just, Lust is like my favorite smell, which sounds corny to me. Like, I went in and I'm like, oh, of course that's my favorite smell so good. Mm. Oh, it's just great. I got this one. I was debating between this and the stick. Um, they also have little bottles. That is like $40 for a little bottle. This one was like $15 for just this little stick, but I figured this I can throw in, a, throw in my purse and take with me. So I really like this little thing. It's just cute. And it even has a use-by date. Like, um, it's not till the year 2014, though. Um, but the Lust Soap, which I will be using tonight, smells like that perfume, and it's like a bright red color. Oh, it's so good. This is... This is $35 per pound. So that's about how much... It's about a mid-price soap for them. This, um, bar... If you can kind of see how big that bar is, um, was 9.22. So I'm really excited to try this today. I'm gonna get out and like put lotion on and then spray this on and just feel like lusty. So I'm really excited. But that was my short haul. Finished wrapping this up since it died on me in the middle of it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you. Bye.